My name is Richard Harvey. I'm an ENT surgeon or otolaryngologist by training, but I only look after disorders of the nose and sinus, and that makes me a rhinologist. I look after patients who have both inflammatory and infective conditions of the nose and sinus, but I also look after tumours and cancers in the area, and I also do nasal reconstruction and complex rhinoplasty work. Having this background makes me part surgeon and also part immunologist of the upper airway. Forehead osteomas are, are a benign growth of the bone of the skull. Small growths occur on our body, such as moles, are a simple growth from the skin, and so too can small growths occur from the bone of the skull. When they do so, they form a hard lump underneath the scalp layer. In the hair layer, it's just simply something that one can feel, but when it occurs on the forehead, it's very much an unsightly lump that's often always in someone's facial profile and photographs, and many people want them removed simply for cosmetic reasons. In the past, the procedures to get to a small bony lump in the middle of someone's forehead or eyebrow were quite invasive. But today, we perform these procedures with tiny incisions in the hairline, perhaps only one centimetre in size. A little camera is used to track down across the forehead to get to these areas and it can be done as a day procedure with little downtime and excellent results.